Hello everyone. So in this video we will learn how to automatically send new text messages to Slack channel. So let us begin with a small example. So the idea is that I'm going to send a message to this particular phone number. Okay, so this is the phone number. So the idea is that if someone sends a message to this particular phone number, it will be reflected as a message on Slack. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to send an SMS. So let me do that. Okay, so I have sent an SMS that Bitcoin prices are up. So let us have a look whether in Slack channel do we have the same message that Bitcoin prices are up. Yes, there is a message Bitcoin prices are up. So you must be thinking, how did I do it? How did I send the text message that I have sent to a particular phone number is now present in my Slack channel. So basically here I have used an integration and automation software called as Public Connect that integrates Twilio to Slack. Now the best part of using this process is there is no need for coding skills or technical background. It can be done easily. So let me just show you the process. So basically in the new tab just type pabli.com p-a-b-b-l-y.com pabli.com press enter. Okay so this is the website of pabli.com just hover on products and here you will find connect. Just click on connect. Okay, so this is the landing page of uh, Pabli Connect. All you have to do is just click on sign up for free. Here you can build your own account in just 2 minutes. In my case, I have already built the account so let me just click on sign in. Okay, so this is the dashboard or the app section of Pabli. Let me just uh, scroll down and here you will find connect. Just click on access now. Okay, so at the top right corner, you will find a button, create workflow, click this, a dialog box appears in front of you, it is asking you to give a name to this workflow. I'm going to give it as Twilio to Slack. Of course, you can give any name according to your choice, it's totally depend on you, Twilio to Slack. And let me just click on create. So when you click on create, you will find two windows, the trigger window as well as the action window. So what's the deal with the trigger window as well as the action window? So when we talk about automation in Pabli Connect, it works on the concept of triggers and action. The trigger means if this happens, then this action should happen. For example, if a new SMS is received in Twilio, the action will be a message will be sent on Slack. So using the trigger window as well as the action window, we are going to create a workflow to integrate Twilio to Slack. Now the best part here is, not only we will be creating a workflow, but also I will add a, I will be adding the workflow in the description box so that you can clone it and directly access it into your account to begin your automation journey right now. Okay, so we have the trigger and here I'm going to select the app as Twilio. Okay, so Twilio it is. Okay, so now in the trigger event, how about we make it as new SMS. So as you can see, we have to make some changes. So first of all, we have to go to the Twilio account and go to the consoles number page. So these are the instructions that we have to follow. Okay, so let me just go to my Twilio account and uh, let me just go to the phone numbers. Okay, so let me just click on this phone numbers and uh, we have to uh, make sure that if anyone sends an SMS to this particular phone number, it will be captured by Public Connect. Okay, so what we are going to do here is we are just going to click on this number. Okay, excellent. And let me just scroll down. Okay, so what's the next step? Click on the phone number we want to use for webhook. Find the messaging section, a message comes in. Okay, so let's go for the messaging section. Okay, so um, in the messaging section, you have to look for a message comes in. Okay, that's what it's in the instruction. A messaging section, a message comes in. Now we have to select the webhook. Okay, so this is the webhook. It is al already auto-selected and here we have to enter the webhook url so where you get the webhook url so let me just go to public connect and copy this this is the webhook url you want okay so it is asking that you select it webhook and paste the webhook url so this is the webhook url and you just paste it here easy okay so all you have to do at this point is just click on save essentially it is showing the number has been successfully updated it means that we have integrated this particular number to Pabli Connect. Okay, so this particular number has been integrated with Pabli Connect. So if someone sends an SMS to this particular number, Pabli Connect will capture the data. So let's do an experiment. So it is already showing it is waiting for the data. So let's do an experiment. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to send a dummy SMS. Okay, to this particular phone number, we are going to send a dummy SMS. So let me do that. 
Okay, so this is basically the screenshot of the SMS that I have sent to this particular phone number. So let me just uh, straight away take you to Pabli Connect because uh, the idea is that if we send an SMS to this particular phone number, it will be captured by Pabli Connect. So let's have a look. Has Pabli Connect captured the detail? So the message is uh, Tron is going down. So let's have a look. Okay, so it is already showing the message has been captured. So we do have the detail. Yes, Tron prices are going down. Excellent. So my idea is that I'm going to send this particular message on my Slack channel. And this is how you do it. In the action window, you select the app as Slack. Slack it is. Okay, excellent. Now in the action event, how about we make it a send channel message without image. This one. And simply just click on connect. We are going with a new connection and let me just click on connect with Slack. Now Pabli Connect is demanding access to my Slack account. So before you press allow, let me just tell you something. Pabli Connect doesn't take any chances with your data. Your data is 100% safe and secure with this. So on the basis of that trust, let me just press allow. Authorization successful. Just press OK. Now we have uh, some fields. The purpose of these fields is very simple. We are going to basically compose a message in Slack from the data that we have received from Twilio via Pabli Connect. So we have the first channel, first field that is channel. And these are all the channels that is present in my Slack account. So let me just show you. So these are all the channels that is present in my Slack account. All the channels that is present here is being simply reflected here. Okay, so as you can see, these are all the channels. Now, what if I create a new channel? Now, of course, uh, you can enter the data in any of the old channels. For example, I'm just going to select this particular channel, product. And we can just compose all the message here and send it to this particular channel. But my plan is I'm going to create a new channel. Why not? Okay, so let me just click on add channel, create a new channel. And the name of the channel is SMS data. Okay, and let me just click on create. So a new channel has been created called as SMS data. Let me just click on done. Okay, so a channel called as SMS data has been created. So let me just go to public connect. And let me just refresh this to uh, check whether we have a new channel called as SMS data. So SMS data, SMS data, SMS data. Yes, we do have a channel called as SMS data. So we have selected this channel. So the message type, let's keep it as plain text. Okay. And in the message, let me just map the message. So this is basically the message. Okay, let me just show you the message. Tron prices are going down. So this is basically the message. We click here, we click here. And this is the message. Tron prices are growing down. Now we have the bot name. My name is Michael. So I'm just going to make sure that I will be sending the name. I will be sending as Michael. The bot icon can be ignored. But in case if you have the URL of an image for bot icon, you can just add it here. Okay, so we have uh, added sufficient details. All you have to do is just click on save and send test request to send the message to this particular channel. And the channel name is SMS data. So let me just go to channel. Yes, as you can see, Tron prices are going down. Excellent. So the presence of this data confirms that we have a successful integration between Twilio and Slack. Now before you leave, let me just explain you the whole mechanism in a nutshell. So let me just uh, minimize the action window and let me just minimize the trigger window. So basically this is the whole process in a nutshell. First you integrated Twilio to Public Connect and then you integrated Public Connect to Slack. So now there's a perfect flow of data between Twilio and Slack. So not just these two applications, you can integrate a ton of applications using Public Connect. Furthermore, the link of the workflow as well as Public Connect is available in the description box. If you have any queries, please contact us at admin at the Moreover, if you like this video, please comment, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.